Gotta keep winning, gotta keep winning, gotta keep winning, winning, winning. What's up, YouTube? Making another video today. Today is gonna be about a referment. Referment is when your truck been broke down for a while, and they take your truck payment and they break it down. I'm gonna show you because my truck was broke down for two weeks. I had electrical issues, so it was broke down for two weeks. So what they done was they gave me a referment for my second week. My first week, I did two loads before it broke down, so that paid all of my truck payment and all my bills on my truck. The second week, I had to get a referment, and I'm going to show you the breakdown of how they did the referment. And I'm also going to show y'all how my first three months taxes, the tax voucher look like. Let's get it. Okay, how the referments work. On this it says, Tell has approved your request to refer your payments for this week ending 4-13-2018. Your makeup payment on this referment will be an additional $153.73 added to your regular payment for the following date. So I had to get the referment for 04-13-2018. 2018. Now my makeup weeks is the 20th to 27th. Oh five four and oh five eleven. So on my wake makeup weeks. I pay an additional $153.73. My regular truck payment is $615. So they add that to the weeks so I don't have to owe on my first week coming back out. Breaking it down like that, every week you still get a truck payment. You still get the truck payment you have to pay, but you still get a check. Okay, right here is my tax voucher. It's really self-explanatory, so I'm really not going to go deep into it. What I got underlined is what I owe for the quarter. I only owe $1,000. I have I only worked about two months. So that's what I have to owe. So I'm just really showing how a tax, tax voucher looks. That's about it on this one. Well, that's about it on this video. I was really just wanted to show, I'm going to try to show everything that, that you got to pay on this side, that you got to do on this side. And I just want to let everybody know too, if it's not warranty, expect to pay something so make sure that you save your money and you put some money back because on the situation with my wiring problem I had to end up paying so I, mean, I just want you to know that up front so you don't think that oh I just got I got bumper to bumper warranty so I ain't got to pay nothing yeah I had to pay to get my truck back out of the shop now you don't have to worry about it too much because I mean we make good money on this side they got the lease program worked out right so you make money you just gotta know how to work it other than that that's all I really got if anything else pop up I'll make another video I'm out peace